Hello friends, good evening, good evening, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in any part of the world. So friends, today I am going to show you something very interest, interesting and exciting feature in Salesforce. So today I have integrated Salesforce with Microsoft Teams. Yes, you can see on my screen, this is my LWC component. And what it does is with basically chats, interacts with my Microsoft Teams. So you must be using Microsoft Teams in your office for communication purpose, internal communication and storing your files, et cetera. And you also been working on LWC. So what I have done is I have I will uh, I will enter a message in the text box. As soon as I click on post message in the Teams, it the message will get posted in the Teams channel. And uh, Secondly, if I want to retrieve all the messages in that particular channel by all the members, I, I will click here and I will be able to see those messages. Yes, so let us proceed to this demo and uh, let me show you the live work, live example, live demo. Okay, so before that, I want to show you the existing messages that are present in my Microsoft Teams channels. So let uh, my Microsoft Teams is installed in my phone. So let me show you my phone. And I'll change the view to a bigger bigger uh, size. Let me go here and let me go to advanced and switch the view so that you can see on the bigger screen. Yes, now you can see that this is my phone. This is my Microsoft Teams. You can see the messages that are present in the Microsoft Teams. This is my team channel, LWC Salesforce integration. You can see at the top. And this is my channel with these messages. The messages are like, hi team, how are you? All these messages are posted by me presently for the demo purpose. I have created this a new channel. So right now, no member is present except me. But if I add any member, then also you can see those messages here. So like, this is hi team, how are you? Good evening. Welcome to the magical world of Salesforce. Let's start the party. Here we go. Good evening. LWC integration and with Microsoft Teams that we successfully, right? So now let me go back to my LWC component and I will show you the live working of this. So let me share my screen again. And let us go back to my, so this is my LWC component. I will enter a new message. Um, hey, hey Salesforce, Real Brothers, how are you doing? Okay, so as soon as I click on this button, post message in Teams, you will see the message will get posted in the Teams instantaneously. So let me click here and let me also pick up my phone again to show you. So this is my, let me click here, post message in my Teams. I have clicked here and the message has been posted. So let me go back to my screen in a bigger view. Let me share again so you can see. I, you can see one second. You can see the message is there in my, so you can see this. Hey Salesforce, can you see this? Hey Salesforce, tell us how are you doing? So, all these messages are present, and the new message is Salesforce, as you can see below, it has been posted in my team channel instantaneously on the click of a button. Okay, so let me go back to my uh, LWC component. So, let me go back to my LWC. Sorry, this is the spelling check. Let me go back to my LWC component and if I click on this get messages button, so I can see all the messages are there in my screen with the sender name and the chat message. So this is the recent message that you can see, hey Salesforce, tell us how are you doing? So all the messages which I have showed you before, so all these messages I am able to retrieve on my LWC component. So, okay. so. So friends, this is the uh, latest integration which I have achieved uh, today and yesterday. I was working on this. This is a very complex integration. So you can try once at your end also. So this is with Microsoft as your directory.
Active Service Directory. It includes the integration settings, permissions, which we have to do on Microsoft Active uh, Direct Azure Active Directory in the Microsoft Azure portal. Okay, so that's all for now, friends. And I have done again uh, one another thing that I will show you in my next video. You must be using Jira. You can see on my screen Jira in your office to to keep a track of your user stories that you do in your project, and you select this put your status accordingly for any particular user story. So, for example, this is my user story MTI one, and this is I select the status. Okay. So suppose your seniors or your managers ask you that there is a particular file in Microsoft Teams SharePoint folder, and you want to suppose a tracker kind of thing where you need to enter your status daily suppose you forget one day then what will happen next day okay so this has happened with me in my previous organization so i had to pay some fine to my seniors basically i had to give them a treat because i have not uh, entered i have skipped uh, somehow to enter my daily Status for a user story in that Excel file that was being put in my Microsoft Teams folder. So since then I have that I, the idea came in my mind. I have automated this. Yes. So, so today also I have automated this. Whatever status is selected here, that will be automatically be posted in the Microsoft Teams uh, Excel file. You need not do anything. The it all happens by Salesforce. The class will be scheduled. At particular time, and it will run automatically. So I am going to show you that feature also in my next video. I have almost completed it. Just I am giving the final touch for this. Okay, so that's all for now. So have a great coming week ahead. Thank you, and have a nice day, and good night, and good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are. Thank you.